Hey guys, this is Casey with First Coast Brews. It seems like everywhere we turn these days, craft breweries are always kicking it up a notch. And First Magnitude Brewery is doing just that. Located in Gainesville, Florida, First Magnitude recently teamed up with researchers at the Florida Museum of Natural History to brew a beer made out of butterfly yeast. Yep, seriously. So naturally, First Coast Brews had to find out more about what makes this beer so unique. Dr. Daniels is the director of the McGuire Center at the Florida Museum of Natural History, and he says that the partnership with the brewery is helping bring awareness to rare butterflies. So we're collaborating with First Magnitude to um, kind of as a way to outreach to the public about raising awareness about many of these really rare butterflies that probably most of the general public knows nothing about, uh, providing an income stream to uh, help fund these efforts. And, and really just connecting people to the organism in a fun, social way. So if they can drink a beer, save a butterfly in the process, everybody wins. So we went up to the Apalachicola National Wildlife, uh, National Forest, uh, collected the butterfly temporarily and swabbed the butterfly for the yeast. And then the brewers at first magnitude uh, grew that yeast and incorporated it actually into the beer. So the beer that you drink will actually have yeast from the butterfly itself. And First Magnitude Brewing is ecstatic to be on board with the project. It's a great partnership, they say, and they both kind of rely on each other. So you rely on really talented scientists from the museum to show you where the butterflies are uh, and then to catch them for you so that you don't hurt them because we wouldn't know how to do that. Uh, and then it's really a process of being as sterile as possible and swabbing them to just collect any wild bacteria, yeast, anything that is existing on their skin. Uh, or I guess, Jared, what's the butterfly cuticle? Um, and then we bring that back and there's a process of, basically we put them onto growth mediums that will only allow yeast to survive. And from there, we just step by step isolate further and further for yeast that are alcohol tolerant and step them up until we've got something we can brew with. I've never heard of butterfly yeast being used in beer before ever. I, I don't believe that, I have not heard of anybody swabbing collecting yeast off of butterflies. Um, people do get yeast off of flowers and stuff, but this is the first time that some, as far as I know, that somebody's been able to like collect yeast from a butterfly, brew a beer with it, help raise funds for that butterfly's conservation. Now, the beer's available at the brewery on draft in Gainesville and in these beautiful cans, but you can also attend their launch in Tallahassee on May 25th. That will be at the Brass Tap in Midtown. Follow First Coast Brews on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram to stay up to date about all the latest beer and craft cocktail news. For now, this is Casey with First Coast Brews. Cheers!